Welcome back to some more. Beautiful World of Warcraft Hardcore. Classic. Oh boy. We have a level 20 rogue. Southbound. No grouping allowed. Anyway, let's play. So yeah. <clears throat> Finally part one of the series actually started to do well. So pretty happy about that. Um, we figured out somewhat, in my opinion, the rotation of this. Because we had issues. But uh, we're doing pretty okay now. Inventory problems. Always fun to have. What's the DPS? 10. Yeah, it's uncomparable, dude. Let's we'll take the small egg. So right now we're just farming the birds. Uh, we need to get uh, tough condor meat. We need to get five of them. We have three in total right now. Then we're gonna finally go hand it back in. So we got another one there. <clears throat> we need one more. So two more levels, then we get our post. And just arm some enemies, but not sure how useful that's gonna be. Majority of the enemies you face will not have a weapon in the main hand, like these birds, for example. So I don't even think you can repost them. Maybe you could just do it for the damage. Because it's next to free, I would say. Okay, we didn't get our meat yet. We'll be fine. We'll do just fine, dude. There's another guy here killing the birds. That's just great. Quest is done now. There we go. All right, so now we gotta kill some more boars, unfortunately. Want to keep the the bird alive for the other guy? That's farming the birds, shame. I killed so many. So we need a great uh, Gortask snout still. We need two of them still. But it looks like it's leading us back now. Because I can get, uh, yeah, we could get it over here. Have a boar over here. Level 17. I recently had a comment that made me thought about stuff again, like how we're doing things on the channel. There's a guy that said, oh great, another person that just posts two hours of gameplay on YouTube. And I'm like, the whole premise of this channel, even the, including the name, is a Let's Play channel. Most Let's Play channels is, like, very unedited uh, content, like it would have been if it was, you know, a stream. And I mean, it could have been a stream, right? But I prefer doing stuff this way because I feel like there's a lot of people that care about you as a person, right? And they enjoy the... It's not everyone, this obviously it's not for everyone, but 
they enjoy the unediting side of YouTube. I mean, sure, if you want to see like highly edited videos and stuff like that, then obviously not going to find it here. Uh, it's just skin. We are a channel of pure unedited content, pretty much. Like I, I do, I do pause my recording every now and then for boring stuff like you know leveling professions, waiting for boats or ferries, um, so that you guys don't have to sit through that, obviously, but. That's pretty much what it comes down to. Step 57, grind until level 20. So we're not going to do that because we are level 20. Kill this boar also. There's another one down there. Beautiful crit numbers, dude. That's what I like to see. We kind of need this. I'm not too sure. Can't remember. Well, that's just really unfortunate. There's a sizable force of gnolls in camp there, and from what you tell me, they are tough ones. It must not have been easy for you to gather this intelligence. Here you are, adventurer. We are grateful for your aid, and if you haven't already done so, speak with Marshal Maris and Magistrate Solomon within Lakeshire. Our situation grows ever more desperate. Those two will have need of you, I'm sure. Someone in the guild is asking, should we go without rested XP or with it? Mm. I feel like leveling in this series is the hardest thing to do. Obviously, if you know the game decently well, I would say play without. But if you don't, right? If you haven't even got a single level 60 yet, I feel like having the guide is definitely the way to go. It teaches you stuff. It tells you where to go. Tells you what to do. The easiest path. Like, obviously, you don't have to use it. But I think the people that do has, like, a substantial benefit above people that don't. Come on, dude. Where is the last one we need? Thank you. Open the toolbox. Hello, you need a bouquet of flowers. You haven't been in town very long. 
Have you already found for yourself a sweetheart here? I know I shouldn't pry, but it's nice to see that love is in the air, especially in dangerous times like these. Here is your bouquet. I chose daffodils for you. They're my favorite. Well done, adventurer. Such fine specimens, too. And here is your delicious delicacy known as Red Ridge Goulash. I can't imagine it tastes good. <laughs> Goodness. Open for business. Let's get down. Let's get down to business. Got one more night, one more night to get this. Oh, wrong one. Wait, what? Oh, that's my back, okay. I feel like we should craft. Let's see our let's go on our cooking. So we can sell the Murloc eyes. We can sell the spider acre. The boar intestines. Wolf of boar meat. A uh, chunk of boar meat, goodness. Wolf of boar meat. <laughs> um, so we could just sell this also then. We have seven, there we go. Okay, that's done. Okay, everything else we keep. Including this. Safe travels. Okay, now they want us to go into the middle here. Jump into the lake, beware of the patrolling elite. Open the sunken chest uh, and loot the toolbox. Patrolling elite. It would have warned us. I think we also have a quest to kill these Murlocs, if I'm not mistaken. At least I do remember one. I was throwing away. Okay, there we go. Travel to Lakeshire. Hey 
Hey there, excellent recovery adventurer. I never thought I'd see these tools again. What a waste of sprint, but I did okay, I think. During the last orc invasion, we were forced to smelt our iron down to make bullets, swords, and armor. We sent word to Stormwind for a new shipment of materials, but a band of Red Ridge Knolls hijacked the caravan and ran off into the hills behind Lakeshire. Now we're coming up short on supplies to get this bridge rebuilt. If you can bring me five iron pikes and five iron rivets, adventurer, I'll make sure you're rewarded. Now let's get to work. So let's go. Work, work. Hey there. Once again, my garden was trampled and pillaged. And I know the brute who is doing it. It's that forsaken boar, the one Marshal Maris has taken to calling Belly Grub. I won't be able to replant the daffodils until next season now. Ruined. All ruined by that one menacing boar. Put an end to that pest. Show me his tusk and I'd be happy to reward you. He seems to spend his time foraging in the field southwest of Lakeshire, but occasionally he roams over here and into my garden. Here is your bouquet. I chose daffodils for you. They're my favorite. Oh, those are lovely. I can't wait to put them in some water. But these are Marty's favorite flowers. Parker didn't have you go to that jealous vixen for this bouquet, did he? You didn't tell her who they were for, did you? If you did, then it wouldn't surprise me if she poisoned them. Oh, but it's not your fault. Thank you, and here's your meal. Another level 60? Dude, I honestly wonder if we're gonna ever reach it. It's gonna be really crazy to survive that long. Where would you like to fly to? Apparently we fly to Stormwind. I'll catch you there. Dum, 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 dum. It's got random fish. Bro, we almost probably have to at some point do fishing to get our cooking up. I can just see that happen as well. Didn't have to run all the way here to just do that, did we? Wait. Can we have armor? I think this is where the uh, cooking trainer is. Hello. It has to be. Be careful. I think it's back here. Looking for some. I sell only the best gear, tested and true, and the prices are set. So if you want to haggle, then go find a goblin. So funny. I sell the best gear. Well, I don't see any gear you're selling. Uh, you're selling junk. At best. <laughs> no, I'm like, uh, I'm kidding. Dude. It's not about that bad. Okay, but it's not gear still. Refreshing water, Mabri.
And we're going to buy more mild spices. We can make this as well. And then, <clears throat> what do they say? Job's done. Okay, not bad. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. Have a good one. Can I help you? Do I look like I have the time or energy to coddle every tourist that wanders through my door? Tell me what you need and make it quick. I sell only the best gear, tested and true. And the prices are set. So if you want to haggle, then go find a goblin. Oh, rot. So now we gotta grab these quests, and then it's gonna tell us to go train our class. But I don't think we have to. I mean, slow movement speed is not that bad, right? We can, we can learn stealth too. But we're only going to use stealth once we have cheap shots. And uh, we get vanish at level 22. That's great. So this is strike level four also. I'm giving a speech on the fortitude of the spirit, and I'd like to recite passages from a particular book on metallurgy. The stresses of iron. A copy of this book should be in the Royal Library within Stormwind Keep. Can you retrieve it for me? If so, then may the blessings of the light be with you. The Royal Library is very large, but the head library in Milton Sheaf knows each shelf like it was his own son. Speak to him. He'll retrieve the book for you. Just found this offhand. Increased damage done by fire spells and effects by six. Increases damage done by frost. It's not that good, actually. Because if you play fire, you won't use frost abilities. And if you're playing frost, you won't use fire abilities. Stormwind. Such a bustling hub of activity. I have traveled from afar to seek help. Often it is heard that brave adventurers roam these city streets. My brother Gershala requires assistance in Darkshore. He resides in the seaside town of Oberdeen. The journey is a long and epic one. It is for this reason that I ask the help of a seasoned adventurer such as yourself. Yeah, look at what this guy is also saying. The reason why it's so cheap is going to be worth 60 silver, right? The reason why it's so cheap is because normally when you play mages, you do, you do get way better staffs, especially in dungeons. So most people will use two hand. We need one cooking dude for 125. That was our first day though. Okay, just finished making the first aids. I don't think we're gonna train the next one. Might be like 115. 
And then I think the one after that is um, we have to go to like I can't even remember where because on Horde it was also in a pretty weird spot. Yeah, I think the only way to get there is through this first. Anyone down for Nomagon later? I might. Was so sad when I saw the item that we could get. Look at that. That's absolutely ridiculous, dude. Plus 11 agility, chess piece. Why did I do this challenge? Or why am I doing it? Eh. Goodness. Metallurgy? Uh, yes, we have many books on the subject and are happy to aid Brother Kristoff with his speech. Now, which particular book was it the good brother needed? The Stresses of Iron. Yes, I know the book. Quite a good one. Written by the dwarven miner Margulf Blagan a few decades ago. He spent most his time deep in the mountains of Kazmodan, digging ore. Smart fellow. But where was I? Oh yes, the stresses of iron. I'm afraid the book was moved to the Northshire Abbey. The caretaker of the Abbey's library, Brother Paxton, wanted to make a copy of the book for his own shelves. But that was months ago. I wonder why it's taking him so long. Try and learn lock picking. Do we really have to go there? Let's have a look. Yeah, I want to check out crippling poison. Might not even use it, to be honest. not a lot of enemies that can get feared or that runs away at low HP. I mean, it's the only time that that is useful. How are you? You look like the type I should watch my coin purse around. Something I can help you with? Huh? Where's, where's my poison? Safe travels. Oh, we have to do a quest. That's how I remember it also. Like you have to finish a quest to get your poisons on your weapon. Because I played a rogue on Horde. Welcome to SI. Seven headquarters, adventurer. Not a moment too soon, adventurer. SI. 
Seven Reconnaissance is reporting unusually heavy Defias activity in Westfall. It would seem that the Defias have taken over an abandoned Alliance watchtower southeast of Sentinel Hill and are using it as a base of operations to smuggle in goods from the Red Ridge supply route. Get to Westfall and contact Agent Kernan for your debriefing. You will find her hidden near the tower. And adventurer, should you be discovered, SI, Seven will disavow all knowledge of your existence. What? Dude, that is broken. This is the world buff, dude. Look how many people are running out, though. The good quest. Oh yeah, I need to exit from the front gate. My bad. Look at this. Increase critical chance by spells by 10%. Median range at 5%. Uh, median range at 5%. And grants you 140 attack power for 2 hours, dude. This is an actual dead player. Looks like a rogue, a night elf. I could be wrong. Could be a male human also. Was low level because he only had dagger in one hand. And how the heck do you die there? Every day like clockwork. I would like to actually get this buff every day. Twenty minutes to seven. No, it's twenty twenty minutes to eight. Oh, they changed the timer just for today, apparently. We also need to repair our gear. Hey there. I'm sorry, I'm a bit busy right now making horseshoes for Werner Osgood in Lakeshire. Yeah, so old Werner needs some shoes, does he? Okay, I'll give him his 50 horseshoes. Here they are, all boxed up and ready to go. Tell Werner it was a pleasure doing business, and be sure he reads the note attached to this crate. We're running back to the human starting zone, dude. What the heck? This might be the rogue quest, actually.
Mr. Sheaf is wondering where his book is? Well, this is a tad embarrassing. I have the book, but I'm still making my copy, and I'm not quite ready to give the original up. I've been meaning to finish my copy of The Stresses of Iron, but, well, you see, I make my own ink for books I copy. It's my own recipe. It doesn't run or smear, and it dries very quickly. Unfortunately, it dries too quickly. My last batch dried up before I could finish the copying job, and I haven't had the chance to make more ink. To make more, I need Rethbin Iron Ore from the Red Ridge Mountains. Foreman Oslo in Lakeshire is my usual supplier. Let's see here. Oh my, Millie's grapes have been saved. When she told me that brigands overran her vineyards, I nearly despaired. But my faith in the light did not waver. And through your bravery, we now have grapes for more wine. May the light bless you, adventurer, and keep you safe. Travel to the Tower of Azura. Ascend the tower. For a shortcut through the mountains. You know, we have this world buff and all we're going to do looks like is just run around. Just like that, you say, huh? So easy peasy, dude. I assume it's on top of the tower. Yeah, talk to him at the, at the top. You need something? This music, though. My rival Morgan is a vicious mage of great power who lives in the Tower of Ilgalar in Redridge. I have developed a means of spying on him, the Eye of Azora, and can now view him from afar. But to study his thoughts, I require further aid. If you are willing, then take my glyph of Azora to the Tower of Ilgalar. Place it upon the lion statue near the tower. When this is done, the power of Azora will grant visions of Morgan's future plans. Okay. Go with honor, friend. Oh shit. Oof. Not worth it, man. I could have ended badly. Very, very badly. Okay, travel back to Red Ridge Mountains. Obviously, we don't have a Pause travel point. Where is this though? Orbitine. It's really far. 
still just have to run there, but uh, I will just catch you guys there, yeah? And we're finally back, baby. Good day. You need what? Maybe you haven't noticed, but we're busy fortifying Lakeshire's defenses and repairing damage from recent orc attacks. If you need Rethbin Iron Ore, you'll have to get it yourself. Rethbin Ore is named after the man who first found it, Bart Rethbin. When smelted, it's not as strong as iron, but its ore has a dark, flat color that some scribes use in their dyes. It can be found in the Rethbin Caverns north of here. We usually have some in stock, but we're too busy preparing for orc attacks to gather any. And besides, Redridge Knolls are now living in the Rethbin Caverns, and their drudgers are gathering the ore themselves. So if you need some, you'll have to get it yourself. Thank you, this really helps me out. But what's this? Argus sent a note with the crate. What? Argus wants me to pay him? Bah! Well, adventurer, thank you for your help. I need some underbelly scales from Black Dragon Whelps to pay for the shoes Argus sent me from Goldshire. If you can get six of them for me, then I can pay Argus with some and have enough left to fashion something for you. Black Dragon Whelps are often flying around south of Lakeshire, but they like to wander. You might have to just keep an eye out and hunt them when you see them. As if the attacking orcs weren't enough. Now I have Knoll Brutes and Mystics prowling along the ridge north of my stable, taking my horses when they stray. If you can get rid of those Knolls, my horses and I would be very grateful. Okay, hey, finally we're gonna kill some stuff with our wolf buff. It's gonna be great. I think we'll have to run out and then up. Level required level one twenty four for that boar. It's a little a little bit above our pay grade at the moment, I think. It's already someone here. Someone just reached level sixty. And if you thought I was farting or something, no, it was my microphone. Goodness. Get absolute trash, dude. This world buff is gonna be broken. Broken! Nah, my buddy. What is this? Level 20. Got a chest here. Get uh, some food bath, I guess. What a useless chest.
got milk. Most of these are double kills, so I'm actually pretty happy we got a bull buff. He's level 22. 4 agility, 3 stamina. Dude, that's insane gloves. Level 22 is dude. We shouldn't be here. Looks like we have a quest here, finding ore. So we need to get into that, uh... We actually need to go this way. Get into the cave. I don't know if we can actually do this. Might be too high level. Still level 20 stuff. We're gonna get spawned on top of though. From a paladin player. Yeah, it says requires level 24. I don't know how many times he missed. Someone in the guild died at level 22.
We got one ore. So that's how we get the ore. Kill the guys that has deal wield and we'll be fine. See, we got spawn on top of. Silly meat. Finally, use this. Oh, shit. Don't forget this uh, plus three stamina buff from a priest. We need eight more mystic dudes. Oh, sorry, we, we need eight in total. It's the casters, actually. stuff dude it's gonna fuck up i can see that happen
Are you crazy? Okay, last one. Wait, we're still not done. Redridge Brute? Wait a minute. Wants us to kill the black dragon now. A good one. Bang of Nulls. Hello, great work, adventurer. These supplies will help the bridge effort immensely. We'll get this beauty shored up in no time. Oh, that's some pretty good pants, dude. For sure. Four strength, four agility. some like crazy panties right there. I feel like the world buff is making this game easy mode. Like, I'm not even kidding. This thing can't even cost and it's dead. Got a wand. So ten brutes will be easy to get, it seems. Just a matter of like waiting for them to spawn. Did we kill that? 
I mean, it's just marked. I think there's more enemies that spawn on this side. More harpies, I think. And nope. So we're not going to find the brutes deeper in. I just died in the guild, level 8. How? How the heck is it possibly? Let's go kill that orc. Now what, dude? We go inverse, we sap one, right? Get wrecked, people. Goodness. Too good at video games, man. I'm kidding. This world buff is just... It makes you feel so strong, dude.
You know that Castor has 1,000 HP, just by the way. It has more than double our health. We're still not done. How many brutes we have? Eight. We need two more. Dude, that thing has disappeared, dude. What the heck? What the heck? Item speech. Why not give my items, huh? You don't like me. One more to go. Wait, but just give me my dudes spawn. I'll catch you guys when they spawn. Goodness, uh, the triple spawn again. Job's done. You see, now it's gonna force me to farm. 
my lock picking, and that's gonna be like a half an hour. Like, I'm not even kidding. Medium hide, bro. That's that's pretty good. That's pretty good stuff. Oh no. There's another player down. Yeah, the spiders, I remember they have big BP. Their poison is nothing to joke about. Okay, so you want to stand like here, just click three the whole time. Which is you train your lock picking until you reach level 80. So this is what you do. So there's enough boxes here for two rogues to train. But I'll catch you guys once we're level 80, I guess. All right. Uh, let me just fix my audio also. So we got 80 skill in lock picking now. That took uh, a little bit longer than it should have. And I wanted wanted it to. Token of thievery. No, mine. No. 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 And I think we can maybe buy it back because I think I had enough scales before. to waste one sprint 101 uh, we can maybe get the scales from here it might be better but I'm gonna quickly just run and see if we can actually buy it back Goods. <laughs> Looks like we sold it. Have a good it's okay, we'll just farm. 
Greetings. Thank you for all your help, Adventurer. Adventurer, the gnolls are still out there. I can hear their baying as they hunt in the hills above Lakeshire. And one cry is louder than the rest. Yowler, their leader. Kill Yowler and send his pack scattering. Bring me his paw as proof. And be careful. This knoll is their leader for a reason. He is no mongrel. It's no mongrel? Are you sure about that? We could just like spam for leather here. So many people playing together. There's a dead body again. People playing together and I'm all alone. There's no one here beside me. No. Stop going for me, harpies. I think there's a harpy up here as well. There it is. Like, I honestly don't know how May just died, dude. Look at this guy. He almost killed at 100% health to zero before it even touched him. Your level up is Frost. Right? You could just spam Frostbolt, literally, and you would kill every everything. Like, I don't care if you're level 8. Like, I, it's, for me, it's questionable. If you double pulled, you just run. You're just killing the harpies, dude. Doesn't need these birds anymore, I guess. Nice try, guy. Need one more?
Job's done. Uh, let's see here. Let us see here. Skills. Skinning. We're now at 126 out of 150. Which is not bad at all. Level 59. You can do it. What can I do for you? Thanks. These will get me out of debt to Argus. Oh, finally. Be careful. Finally, dude. We have some green shoes. So now everything is green. Well, except our weapons now. But I... The liberty changed it to white. Oh, cracked it open, did you? Nice work, adventurer. If you die now, we can rest easy, knowing it was due to your own stupidity and not inexperience. Uh, delete the certificate theory from your bags. As long as, uh, because it's no longer deleted. Use Hearthstone. Or don't mind if I do. Your body looks worn and your spirit weary. Rest yourself beneath our roof and allow Elune to guide your dreams. Accept a wanted quest. I am devising a potion that requires rare mushrooms. Mushrooms that grow only in a certain cave. The cave lies behind Cliff Spring Falls, to the east and slightly north along the mountains. I would go there myself, but I was advised by the Grove of the Ancients to stay away from that place. Our venerable allies sense that the cave is the hiding place for a new evil in Darkshore. Please, adventurer, gather the mushrooms for me. And while doing so, scout the cave to confirm the Ancients' fears. What an honor it was when Master Grey Whisker assigned me to work under the guidance of the great prospector Remtravel. At the Academy in Ironforge, everyone knew of Remtravel's great discoveries, but the prospector is rather, um, oblivious to his surroundings. We had uncovered evidence of a great society. Horrible golems sprang forth from the ground and overran the site. Remtravel never seemed to notice. I ran back to Oberdeen for help. Please travel south and see if the prospector is okay. Don't have to tell me twice, girl. Ooh, we leveled up. Let's get it. Wait a minute. Oh, there goes our sprint. Ah, so my brother Argos sent you? I realize you must be weary from your travels, but we have much to talk about. Foolish blood elves toil with demonic magic. Have they not witnessed what happened with the Naga and with the satyrs of Kalimdor? I fear that the blood elves will meet a similar deformation. Azeroth cannot afford to give birth to another vile race of monsters. 
I wish to study the brain stems of the satyr and naga so that I might deduce what fate the elves are headed toward. In Black Fathom Deeps, on the coast of Ashenvale, you will find both satyr and naga. Tis a long journey, adventurer. Yeah, that axe is actually pretty insane. It's a very slow axe as well. Five strength, five agility. That's like a, a warrior's dream right there, and a weapon. Okay, we're just making our way downtown. Walk and face, I guess. We'll see how hard these enemies is. World buff should be fine. I feel like we should save our scrolls for once the world buff is done. Because, I mean, like, 5 strength, 5 agility is a pretty big buff from scrolls. Thank you. Old buff is broken, dude. Goodness. Six healing does the same DPS. Beware that the cubs can stun you for two for two seconds. Wait, 
Wait. What? Got my first shoulder pads, bro. Okay, it wants us to kill the mother there now. First. I feel like the question should be, who do we kill first? Fight is a lot easier than I thought it's going to be. I came here with the hunter tried, uh, trying to tame that bear uh, because it's pretty important. Uh, this bear gives you claw and bite. What happened here? That was scary.
What? Open the bag. He'll open the demon bag. Oh my goodness. was a little confusing. Do in inventory spaces uh, available still? Stay on the upper section.
Okay. So it's not killing enemies, it's actually looting. Don't need this, I think. Don't need bananas. There's another one we missed there. Or or it respawned, I'm not sure. There's level 15 rare here. I don't see where the marker is. Looks like we're gonna hand in stuff first. Gotta go fast, baby. I remember these quests down here was not fun to do. Low drop rate and stuff. I think. Like, I haven't... When I, when I started playing WoW, I was Alliance. Right? My very first character ever was a... A Drenai Shaman in Burning Crusade. That was my first time ever starting to play WoW. It wasn't a South African server as well, a, a private server. Um, I don't know, man. Like, it was okay, I guess. We played for about a few months, about three or four months. And then the server got DDoSed and... Uh, Apparently the the server host got hacked and he had to like restart the whole server and uh, everyone started back from level one again, right? No one's data was saved. Uh, so that's when my friend and I decided, hey, let's take the game a little bit more serious, right? Let's rather just, you know, play on retail. So we started playing on retail. And that's pretty much when Wrath of the Lich King started, so... Played Burning Crusade Private and played Retail. Started playing Retail on Wrath of the Lich King. We went to max level, we did... Uh, mostly just dungeons because we couldn't raid. It's a private server, dude. Not enough people. Right. So we were five friends from school that played well on, on this private server. And it was just me and my one friend that started playing retail. The other the other friends uh, decided to not play well.
Greetings, person. I am Tharnarian Tree Tender. You have fought for Oberdeen with bravery and honor, adventurer. In our war-torn lands, death and despair are common. Many will not rise to meet the challenge of life in our new home, choosing instead to hide in their homes or escape to the more fortified lands of the Alliance. Thank you, adventurer. Perhaps someday soon we shall fight alongside as comrades versus another foe. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Are you doing good, eh? Dude, what is this inventory now? What is this inventory, dude? See you soon. I am. We have just begun this war to reclaim our forest from the forces of corruption. But a battle this day has been won. Adventurer, the people of Aberdeen owe you a debt of gratitude that will never be easily repaid. Please accept this along with our thanks. What we have learned here today may one day free our Burbog friends from the shackles of torment permanently. Are you sure about that? Peace. Many thanks, adventurer. These mushrooms are fine specimens. And when you were at Cliff Spring Falls, did you find anything to confirm the warnings of the ancients? The ancients are wise, but I had hoped that this time they were wrong. Onu, an ancient of lore at the Grove of the Ancients, knows of your journey to Cliffwater Falls and wishes to speak with you. The grove lies to the south, nestled near the mountains. The ancients are patient and wise, adventurer. But if Onu seeks your counsel concerning what you saw in the falls, then I fear it is urgent. Uh, we can actually delete that. Uh, whoa, we got a BFD dungeon quest, dude. Uh, we can also get rid of this quest here. You have to train fishing and then you can actually get that um, rod for free, I guess. I think. Not entirely sure. So uh, long to run, bro. Good news. Shouldn't we just stick on the path? It's safer. Not that it's dangerous here, we're high level, but... We could just run, you know. Auto run all the way there. Our world buff is gonna be done soon. Alright, we have repose soon, bro. We're halfway there to the next level. Gonna spam the crap out of this ability. Six second cooldown. It takes 10 energy to do 150% of your weapon damage. That just sounds too good to be true. Then it seems like we take hit chance, and then I guess we're gonna take offhand damage. Oh, 
I find it weird that we don't uh, that, that we don't take this. Reduce the cooldown of your sprint and evasion by 45 seconds. Two skill points. That's a minute and a half cooldown. Deduction. Is it deduction or reduction? Hmm. Should be reduction, I think. Be not that kind of orc. It really to work. Work, work. Gotta kill grizzly bears again. I wonder if you can only repost if, uh, if it has a main we a main hand weapon. Because I think repose should still go through, but it should just not disarm. If set target is dis undisarmable. So the rest of the XP giving errors. Not cool, mean. Moonstalker pelt. So we need to kill the uh, the cats also. Guess we're going down. Click on something here. What the heck? Uh, oh. What the heck, book? I'm gonna spank you soon, dude. Uh, turn in the Twilight Camp, except the turn of owner.
There we go. Dude, I'm gonna slap a book soon. Ah, the great outdoors. Looks like we got a escort quest. She's walking for the A team, dude. It's so loud, her footsteps. No wonder people are like getting pulled from everywhere. She's so loud. Trying to make a run for it, okay? Could she be any louder when she walks? I couldn't pick up that book. Oh, we have one. Destroy this item, no longer need it. Windstalker pouts. We need five of them. I just don't get pulled from far away. Oh, it's level 19. What? The other guy disappeared before I can loot it? They're they're cheating, dude. They're they're cheating. Why are you cheating? Guys, we're going to actually end this episode over here. Hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you are new, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.